All right, people, I'm back. Even though you got a post yesterday. <laughs> we're gonna watch Andrew, you know where you know. It's Andrew Tate, we're gonna see if he's funny or not. You know, we're gonna see why he's famous right now. He's like on every TikTok I've seen since the month and last month and the month before that, every time I scroll, that's what I see. And we're just gonna, you're gonna, we're gonna see what Andrew Tate's all about on these clips and what made him famous. So let's go. Little electric, my little plug. Ooh, let, me, let me get my little plug and plug it into my Tesla. Mm, maybe I can get an erection one day. Is this the man you are? Slap, slap, grab, choke, shut up, bitch, sex. These things the left try and present, you have to keep things realistic. No. <laughs> no. Years ago, natural selection and evolution would have taken care of all your fucking retard ancestors, but yet here you are, standing my face saying you don't eat gluten. Yes, you fucking do. All right. Everybody hates gluten. It's over. He got you. Why do I make that face? Okay. Only a cat owning bitch would complain to the police about a fucking joke. Fine, you're upset you lost your cat. Fair enough. Yeah, the joke may have been a little bit, you know, risque. Who calls the police on a fucking joke? Cat owners. Cat owners are liberals. Cat owners believe in hate speech. Cat owners are Democrats. Cat owners are. De wow. If you own a cat, you're all that in a bag of chips. <laughs> and you can't take a joke. That's crazy. Hey kids, you look like a bitch. No, I'm not like these fucking mask wearers. No. Oh my goodness. Not a mask wearer. And the girl behind him is wearing a mask. He doesn't care about nothing. I walk into hell and the devil's like, oh, I'm going to burn you. Are you going to shit? I find myself super funny. <laughs> I find myself super funny. Imagine I'm in I'm in my fucking six liter B12 Aston Martin Vanquish. Gets about ten miles to the gallon max. I'm sitting there. I'm chilling. There's a traffic jam. No big deal. Whatever. Big Daddy Tate. I can handle it. Someone goes. There's a climate change activist <laughs> and they blocked the road. Oh, he's gonna hit him. What? There's climate change activism, extinction rebellion. Yeah, I'll show you an extinction. Oh my God, exactly, he's gonna hit him. Which is, that's probably the most annoying protest ever to block the road. No, and you can't, you're not gonna stop it by blocking cars, this protest, you gotta figure something else out because the pollution is everywhere. It's just, I don't think, there's not much you can do, but there's something different you can do. Definitely something different, maybe not, Put your life in danger also. There could be another way. But inconveniencing people is actually a smart move because if you inconvenience people, then it gets people's attention. You know what? I don't know. I, I'm i just speaking to myself anyway, but okay. You're a fat, ugly sack of shit. To a poor country, no one's depressed. If they have food and their family members oh, are alive, kitty. they're all laughing and dancing. Africans ain't even got roofs on their houses. Every time you fucking look at a documentary, they oh all my start God. dancing around. I ain't dancing around like that ever. I'm never that happy. What the fuck are you happy about? <laughs> I mean, if you're a really good friend, no, not even if you're a friend. You better, if you're my friend, you just can't be a pussy. Well, I had a heart attack. Get the fuck up. <laughs> and the most annoying thing about this fat cunt is that when he's DJ, he MCs. And when he MCs, all he says over and over again is, oh my God. I wonder what DJ is talking about. Bodybuilding is a beauty pageant where dudes try their best to put on muscle so other dudes can say, you're the best looking dude. <laughs> it's gay, <laughs> it's super gay. I said, tell him it's gay all the time. It's not gay, it's hard work, dedication, blah, blah, blah. Some of history's greatest. It's crazy. You only get buffed to look at other dudes apparently. Not for your health or anything. The most influential men have been cigar smokers. Sir Winston Churchill, Jack Nicholson, and of course, Hannibal Smith from the AT. Long, cold, lonely night. She's saying, I don't care if you're a rocket scientist. I don't care if you're a businessman. I don't care how successful you are. I don't care about nothing. I need dick. Because if, if I'm kept warm, dicked right, on a long, cold, lonely night, any night. Basically, I'm a hoe. I need dick. That's all I'm interested in. What planet is this? They're they on the radio back and forth. Back they and can't just be putting these clips up here out of context because it sounds really, really horrible for him. But obviously, he's got to be talking about a female, but out of context, it sounds like he's talking about himself. And, and I heard the little one, the little hijabi one, say, oh, uh, maybe we need a male officer. Basically saying, we can't arrest this dude. So these two little women who can't arrest Dang. him. 
but threatening to. Can't chase anyone, but telling me I have to fucking sit still. So I said, okay, I agree. This is my public declaration. I got my phone out and start recording. I wish I still had this fucking video. This is my declaration. I agree. I will not chase the car. I'm saying now I'm free to go. I'm not a criminal. I'm free to go. I will not chase the car. And they were like, they knew I was lying. <laughs> they were like, he's going to go chase the car. Are we gamblers? Where's your mask? <laughs> what do you mask? Mask. What do you mean mask? No, it just tastes really Let me tell you a secret, Luke. I'll kick the motherfucking fuck out of you. Sure, I know you said Rando. money isn't real, but I am getting fucked. <laughs> just threw more money at him? <laughs> I wish. What pisses me off most, you thick fucks? Beer break. Garden. Exactly. And that was the only time that today only that time. people have been talking about each other's back. This guy's a liar. That was the only time. Listen, bro, just be, don't talk to me right now, okay? Apparently, he said he was on this reality TV show, right? And he got kicked off because they were too scared that he would beat up the other people because they were so mad. They were so angry at him but because he, he, he had control over their emotions, basically. And he's a professional fighter or kickboxing a champion. Like, I don't even know how many times he's won or whatever. Point is, he can destroy regular people no matter how big they are. It doesn't matter. And every dude is mad so he, and they didn't want to fight so they kicked him off the show. Five words and I'll walk I'm, off of you on. Yeah? Why would you come in here and start like that though? Why wouldn't you introduce yourself and then tell us tomorrow or something? Be okay. respectful because respect you come into guy. here. You came into here and we caught eight of us snakes. Yeah. Of course. You didn't even, you didn't oh, even yeah. tell us your you? name. All you did was go oh, eight fuck. of you are snakes. Stood up. Just stood up really quick. And as I stood up, he shat he himself it. and dropped his pen. I stood up and he went, Oh no, it's not. And dropped his pen. <laughs> this is the, these these are your masters. You mess with me, you're gonna learn something. Hey, yeah. Ain't ready for the big man slap. I got a big hand. <laughs> I'll bust their jaw with the bottom of my hand, and the top of their head will feel the sting from the fingers. Like the whole boom. Is, uh, Dang. Dave, yeah. Like okay. And B, That's a sick of a slap. It's fine. Film anything, Dave. He he told me it's fine. He told me it's okay. He said it's alright. So just just follow us around. I want to see every edit before it goes out. Ooh, then that's gonna be. All right, if you agree. Driving it. You drive every edit. I'm not even paying for this. I want to make it very. Don't be taking the piss and just trying to make me look like a cunt because that's the last. Too easily done. I like where the street lights are. You saw that? Is it cold in Romania? Yes, Dave. It's cold in Romania. That where they put that clean film around. It's Why? To, it's to prevent people from putting stuff in your suitcases or taking stuff out of your suitcases. But who's going to put shit in your suitcase after you check it in? It's uh, people that work at the airport, they smuggle drugs by putting it in people's suitcases and then a person Dang. on the other side will take it out of the suitcase. I, I'm sorry, James. I do not believe that shit for a second. Who had a knife? You saw that knife? That knife was cool. That was a cool knife. And what he said about the people doing that, it just sounds a bit extra. A lot extra, actually, because how do they gonna know which bags to look in? You can't just put it in a random bag. That, I'm, I'm with Andrew Tate on that one. That sounds uh, a bit of a stretch. It's possible, but it seems like it's too much work. They suck non-stop. Hi. Nice to meet you. Fuck off. <laughs> and second, that's not nice. Second, <laughs> police should be allowed to have weapons. The army and the maybe police. The army and the police. The ones who aren't racist. Okay. I want you to listen to a song. And every 11 to 12 seconds, say, oh my God, over it. And after an hour, I guarantee you feel like murder. <laughs> but the French are weird. One dude, he must have been about 50, got naked, then go on the dance floor and just like start to dance. <laughs> just like, oh, why? Why? Why would you do that? Why would you get completely naked? If you want to dance, just dance. Like, why would you get completely naked and just go do your shit dancing? They don't eat gluten. I need you to do something. Yeah, yeah, sure to know what oh, it's just a repeat. So what happens is you're standing now. there and they say, oh, I don't actually eat gluten. Get in the cage and I'll show you what toxic is. Your wife can watch from somewhere at the back. This is Romania. We've got beautiful women around. It's going to be like hot <laughs> chicks around. She has to be <laughs> like hot chicks. Something. Well, that was that. Thanks for watching the video. Let me know if you thought that was funny. For some reason, Andrew Tate's funny to me, probably because he just doesn't care, and I think that's funny sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>